don't want to say incredible, but I mean, it really is a world-class performance from these, you know, young men. And the excitement that they bring to the idea of doing this together is uh, very rewarding to me. I think the guys are going to come away from this this week and and ha and share that kind of excitement with what we did. No, whatever you just did. Let, let that open core just ring. First one. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. How it feels to create this new 21st century version of the song. To me, I hear all of the elements in the track that are in my heart and in my spirit. I, you're a very legible singer, and, and that's one thing that helps because it is a story. And it's not something, it's not a personal experience. Chances are tonight when you go out and look in the sky, you're not going to see cowboys. Instead of telling you what notes to play, he would uh, give you an idea of what he wanted to hear and then he'd allow you to be creative and go ahead and put what you felt needed to go there. It's been an absolute pleasure working with him. He, uh, you know, he doesn't, uh, he doesn't tell you what to play, what notes to play, but he'll, he'll give you an idea and uh, he'll kind of let you run with it. And uh, he, uh, it's amazing how he'll just pull it out of you. Please, we love you, but... We, we want what you got in there, man. Let's go from the top again. Uh... It's just one of those incredible songs that is open to interpretation. And uh, I think the guys this week really uh, uh, made a significant impression with it. The song really has a very special place in my heart, in my life, because this song got me this gig, and now this song is gonna be the launching pad for this new project, and I, I couldn't think of a better way to, um, to start to create the legacy of the Badlands House Band of Ghost Riders in the Sky. It's, it's, it's totally been a dream come true, you know, to. Uh, to be in the studio and work with Henry Paul, not just Henry Paul, but on this particular song, you know, this this iconic, you know, uh, Ghost Riders cut. And uh, yeah, it's totally been a dream come true. You know, it's hard to say how big hits happen. Uh, usually they come on the heels of major label commitments and a great deal of promotional money spent. I think that the record we made on this song is a hit song. I think it's a hit record. What's really cool is to hear Henry call it a record. I absolutely love that. And uh, he wanted me to play like I play, which I really appreciated. And he kind of let us do things our way, while at the same time, it was him creating the actual flavor. An important element of the Badlands House Band is that power and that energy and that larger than life arena rock mentality. So uh, it's really uh, an honor to to have this be our first single, to be our opening statement, as you will, uh, in the career history of the Badlands House Band. Nobody on the planet in history has sung this song more than this guy. Nobody's closer to it than he is. And uh, to have him be a part of our version has been an honor, a thrill, and uh, great job, Hank. Thanks, yeah. thanks.